Hey guys, it's Geeks Plus 16. Welcome back to Let's Play Banjo 2. Well, today, I'll, of course, continue for Pterodactyl Land. Get these springy steps shoes. So I'm gonna get to the top of this little pedestal here. Who's this? Chumposaurus, stomach cramped carnivore. Wait a minute, this ain't on a boss battle, is it? What's he doing? What in the world? Okay, he just ate us and... Okay, now I'm switching up. Can you hear me in there? I won't digest you if you help me out with my little pro stomach problem. Stomach problem? Do you want to hear what you ha got to do? Huh, let's see what he has for us. These nasty blarg ulcers keep appearing from my stomach lining and they really hurt. I want you to shoot them before they disappear again. Blue ones are worth three points. Green ones are worth two points. And red are only worth one point. If you can score 75 points, you'll ease the pain a lot. So yeah, apparently he's got ulcers. So what you gotta do is you get the special eggs again with free gold blaster mode. And you shoot these um, ulcers, and the, he said the limit is 75. And they score it 75, and you get over that, you. Uh, but this game's not that hard, really. So. Come on. Oh, crap, I need to get... Oh, man, I don't know, guys. I don't think I'm going to be able to do it. Well, maybe, maybe. They quit disappearing. Yes! I barely did it. <laughs> and once we help him out here, he gives us a jiggy. Apparently, I don't know how he... He said the jiggy, thought the jiggy was a biscuit. <laughs> And no, I don't want to play again. So let's get out of here before he, before something else happens. Okay, he'll spit us back out. All right. I guess dinosaurs can have ulcers. I guess. Okay, now let's go ahead and um, continue on with our journey, I guess. I'm going over to Mumbo's. Well, click. I'm just going to activate the work pad. So get the the uh, wading boots across this quicksand here, and there's a Mumbo pad. We're not going to do that just yet. I just came over here to activate the uh, warp pad. I guess I'll get this glove over here. There's a ledge here we can grip grab. Yeah, no one of these stupid slap dragons. Come on. Die. There we go. Oh yeah, builder or boulder I just did, and you get a Cheeto page, which is number. Let's see, is that the first one or the second one? I can't remember. Let me check. Okay, that's the first one, and we just need to find one more empty honeycomb, and, and the rest is history, I guess. So I'm going to go back on the work pad and 
go back to the world in, world in the entry world entry and exit. Let's go up here real quick. We are in the Stratosaurus family cave. Get rid of that and get some more honeycomb. Get some more energy. Okay, we're gonna build this boulder here. And apparently we got a Dino family. That's in one Dino's in trouble. So let's talk to the uh, dinosaur here. Stratosaur is here. Go away, leave Scrotty alone. Well, if that's how you greet visitors, why are you so sad? My family isn't keeping too well. Now you've done it, Banjo. Just wait until you hear all the problems she wants us to fix. Look at my eldest scrap. He's very sickly and needs a doctor urgently. Which doctor? I don't care. Any doctor will do. I've heard there's a crazy shaman that lives on the clifftop who might help. Script here was out walking one day and came back this us. Now he's too proper to be a dinosaur. Grunt has gone missing. She took some money from my purse and hurried it, hit it off to the train station. So many problems. I told you so, Banjo. We'll see what we can do. Wonderful. It's nice to know not every character in this game is bad. So yeah, apparently the Stratosaurus family is kind of not keeping well, which... She says Scrit is too small in order to fix him is something to do with that mumbo pad and that will help him with size. Of course the missing Dino Scrum, which we rescued from the Cave of Horrors and Witchy World, so all we need to do is summon Chuffy and she'll come back. And Scrit, which um Scrotty here said um that we should there's a doctor, which of course the shaman she's referring to is Mumbo on the cliff top. So we figure out what the Isle Hag's cliff top Mumbo does, so But that will be for much later. Get rid of him. So we'll deal with some of the stuff a little bit later, so. Dang, I feel like this is going by very slow to me, though. Um, I'm gonna go through here to the next part of Pterodactyl Land. Eh, you know, Ash I don't care. It's a big dino switch. Okay, look what we got over here. Is a train station switch. What that does, we'll open the doors to the Pterodactyl train station so Chuffy can come through here. So, alright. Okay. Okay, here's a boulder over here. So let's build your lit. And that is the Treble Cliff, which will give us 85 notes. Which I, I, let's see, last time I checked, there was 65 notes that we have. And I'll go ahead and find those now. Okay, there's another Mumble Pad in front of Wombas, but we'll go there later. And where's the spring step shoes at? Um, let me 
me see if there's anything through here. I can't remember what this way goes to. Oh, Unga Bunga, back to Unga Bunga's cave. Okay. Hmm. You know what? Um, well, while I'm here, I'll go ahead and, um, go ahead and get that egg. That last, that next to last egg in here. So I'm going to split up Banjo and Kazooie again. Well, actually, three of the four babies, so there's one more, and it's in the Oogly Boogly Cave, but we gotta find a way to move that cave in so we can access that cave area. Okay, I'm gonna go out through this way here. Dang, I feel like I haven't made much pro progress, though. So, so let's leave. Now I'm almost at the 15 minute mark, that's where I normally stop the videos, because I think for Let's Play, it's 15 minutes is a good amount of time, I mean, even though I can do unlimited time, but I think it's just too much, okay. Okay, here's a Jiggy, but how do we get to it? Only when the secret code of the dinosaurs is heard will this Jiggy be yours. And I know exactly how to get that, so if that doesn't help, it will be one of the Mamba transformations. But through here, we got the next to last Rock, rock Nut tribe member. So, so let's go ahead and get the Quack Clerk Kazooie egg out. Be careful here, because if this thing falls, you have to get a, crack out another kazooie egg. So let's go through here, and boom. <laughs> so I think there's, yep, there's one more left. all the notes yet? Yep, I've gotten all the notes. I'm gonna get the springy step shoes back out so I can do this. Go up here and stand on this little stand on ground platform and look what we got here. A dinosaur, apparently he's thirsty. And it's Dippy, seeker of beverages. He's thirsty. Ugh, so thirsty. I need water badly. Why not go and look for some then? It's not going to just drop out of the sky. The sun burns poor Dippy, so I must stay in my cave. Please get me a drink. Yeah, there ain't much we can do f to the him right now. Much, much, much later, we have to get the water from World 8 and somehow transport it here. So, so World 8, which is the next to last world, well, last G-Clicking world, now, let's go through down here, because there is something we need to get. It's a Cheeto page, but how do we get to that Cheeto page? I don't know. Hang on a minute! So, I'll see you guys next time for more Let's Play Banjo-Tooie. So, later.